Hello and when I'm from Crypto Matings and today I'm going to be doing Token Lens. Token Lens is an economic NFT game based on VAX platform, fighting five contracts for internet token, T tokens and military supremacy. As you can see, start your own collection. These are the NFTs in the game. As you can see, these are some good looking NFTs. <sighs> Please tag game pack sale. This was on 26 February, so it's already over, but you can still buy them on Atomic Hub. I will show you later how to buy these these packs token lens gameplay continents the void of the token lens game represents five competing content divided into nft sectors joining one of the continent yet you get numerous options to get an internal token lens currency t coin t coin each continent has a certain resource necessary for creating an nft card war factory military and economic advantage of ever playing Effect the state of fate of the whole continent land sectors. NFT card of varying rarity that contains slots for staking infrastructure facilities along with the amount of workers works for working sector owners will get a stable 10% profit margin gain from all facilities placed in the sector together with profits from all com Completed works. NFT card can be purchased in packs with bags at the pre-sale stage and in rare cases at auction with T-Coin. Working. Every token land players can earn T coins and any continent in any available sector absolutely for free. Fulfilling works, you can you earn T coins and get the chance to obtain an NFT evolution card. Evolution NFT card of varying variety that increase profit from working. Once used, the card is token taken out of the system, adding. 2% to 10% to the work efficiency. This NFT card can be purchased for at auctions with T coins and in rare cases can be obtained for free when fulfilling works. Staking Owners of NFT cards from the commercial objects collection can place them in a free sector on any continent and earn T coins. It's the fastest and easiest ways to earn <coughs> T coins and become an influencer token lens player. Commercial objects A unique collection of NFT cards are very varying rarity that allow their owners to earn t-coins by placing them in sectors profit from commercial objects are fixed and depends on the rarity of the card more powerful nft cards can be purchased in packs with wax at the pre-sale stage while less powerful cards can be only be bought in auction with t-coins auction this game incorporates an nft card infrastructure facilities sectors improving players attributes with t-coins selling system implemented through auctions nft card purchases and auction are less profitable than cards obtained at the pre-sale stage bank the game introduces a t-coin deposit option of for time from 1 to 12 months the interest rate on the deposit depends on its terms in case of an early withdrawal the contract interest rate is not changed token land bank will not with that nft card drawing among invest investors Mining. Each of the five continents has mines for mining NFT sources. You can use them to build a war factory or for selling pur purposes. Mine. Each continent has its own mine with a unique NFT source. Metal, glass, brick, fuel and chips. For mining, you still need, you will need T-coins. The resources are limited and go with daily updates. War factory. A mythical NFT card that can only be obtained by crafting unique NFT sources is the most profitable infrastructure facility which gives you T-Coins along with generating NFT military cards. War In a war between the continents, the winner is determined by summarizing powers of all NFT military cards on the continent. The victorious continent gets a week of an increased T-Coin mining cap capability from staking and working. The concept of war makes it impossible for content to win all the time as well as for players to move to a continent with increased profit roadmap got a website launch and social community building game concept presentation nft card series one presentation thousand plus nft staking card year drop pre-sale one and pre-sale two this is already done this is also already done launch of t-coin on possibility of trading working modes staking mode auction bank function quarter to 22 gameplay updates mining mode nft drops to unique resources war factory craft nft craft cards series 2 presentation quarter 322 war is begin continent bonus t-coin staking big surprise to all the community now let's check out their social media accounts as you can see they also have a twitter account if you if you, you should also follow, always follow them on uh, Twitter if you want to give, be up to date about the project they have 18.9k followers you can also follow them on join their group on uh, telegram they have uh, 15,369 members 
and you can also join them on on the discord server they have 16 for the member day i will share these links in my description so you don't have to worry about them now let's check this you can you can play the game through vox vex cloud wallet or anchor now let's review this now let's check out the gameplay presentation of how to play the game this is the roadmap that we already covered token lens gameplay anyone with the wax wallet can register in the token lens game and participate in the gameplay absolutely for free you can get what how to create works for it you can check it out owner as you can see these are the things on a show sector owners how many staking slots they have and how many of them are full war power shows how much military power your account has full staking power shows how many t coins you receive by day for all your staked nft cards balance shows how many t coins you have in your wax wallet rewards show how many t coins you can claim from your staking nft cards to the right of the avatar displays the resources and the amount in your wallet depending on the rarity this one the black progress bar shows how much in percentage your account is improved which affects the number of mine sequence when using the work function and war power click the button up and to use level up nft cards this one claim button for claim you reward uh, your reward from checking cards when you hover over a continent you get information about the continent staking slot shows how many places for staking slots on a given continent and how many of them are occupied work shows how many jobs are available on the continent within 24 hours and how many of them have already been completed war power shows how much war power the players located on the continent have mine shows the total number of available resources per day on a given continent and how many of them have already been mined the selected content is highlighted in green until the Y begins in the game movement arrows the <sighs> these are the first step first of all you must choose continent and after that you can see continent page on this page you can choose what you want to do work absolutely free function you go to work for 8 hours and get one t-coin for it if you work in a sector other than US, you will be charged a 10% sector on the commission if your account is improved you will receive more t-coins according to the percentage of your improvement if you go to work you will not be able to mine during the time allotted to work 8 hours mine you go to mine the resources for 8 hours and must pay 25 t coins to visit the mine in that to, in return you get a resource that is located on the continent it will be displayed on the right side of the main panel a combination of resources card creates a mythical nft card if you go to the mine you will not be able to work during the time allotted to visit them as you can see if you work you can mine if you mine you can't work you only do one of these things stake this feature is for staking your nft card you can stake as many cards as they are free stake slots in the sector for example the common sector can hold 100 staking cards staking limit is 100 20 are already occupied that means you can stake 80 cards in this sector if you stake cards in a sector other than yours you will be charged a 10 percent sector on the commission funds from staking cards will be displayed in the main panel in the selection device to credit these funds to your balance you must click the button claim a filter is available by the number of available works, the number of face slots for the stake NFT and such name. As you can see, this is the bank function for different weak contracts, coins you invest, chance, box step chance, T coin percentage, and these are the boxes mini, small, big, mega, and grand. And you can see these are the chances of the packs bank, mini pack, bank, small pack, bank, big pack. You can buy these in Atomic Hub any of these packs as you can see different packs have different percentage of the rarity you can also craft in this game you should read this before playing the game for better understanding this is about wall of continents token lands let's start the game and see a little bit about the game and then let's check out the market As you can see, these are the continents. 
they say sticking slots work were work power than mine this is the bar this is the claim button that is what they were talking about these are the resources you can craft through here and this is the auction it's not available right now you should read it more to completely understand how to craft and stuff as you can see you, you, you have to be careful when selecting a content because you won't be able to change it later this is the bank you can deposit there's a price chance for different for different things now let's check the uh, market as you can see this is a my this is the atomic page token lens we can view them on market you can check ev everything you want you can buy it here be it sectors resources taking things avatars packs let's check packs for starting the game like i showed you before there were three types of packs game start big but like see if you want to start with this pack you can just search it here uh what was it called game set ultimate pack not big uh it's start not star my bad as you can see you can copy these and you can select here from lower so you don't have to pay the price as you can see the there are like eight pe seven people selling this and the lowest price is fourteen hundred four hundred ten dollars you can buy other packs as well just copy them search it here select the lowest and you can select the price if you want some sectors to buy you can also buy them you want to check highest price lowest price whatever you want there are avatars here packs upheaval promo codes resources if you're if you're low on resources you can also buy them here and and and, and among other things and that's all for me today thanks for watching and see you in the next video goodbye